There's a current bill in the Montana legislature that would look to ban enforcement of texting and driving for Montana cities. The city of Bozeman is actually one of those cities that has an ordinance that bans the use of mobile devices. I teach them that texting and driving is absolutely one of the most dangerous things they can do. Jerry Bauer has been teaching new drivers off and on for nearly 50 years. He teaches his students to avoid distractions on the road. Try and help them recognize also that um, uh, texting and driving is, is very addictive. According to the Montana Department of Transportation, there are only 15 locations around Montana with a ban on the use of mobile devices while driving. That's called a hands-free ordinance and that was put into, uh, into existence in 2012. The proposed legislation would not allow any bans on cell phone use to include texting and driving unless local ordinances allow for hands-free use. In Butte Silver Bow, Sheriff Ed Lester told us there's an exemption for hands-free use only with your mobile devices while you drive. In Bozeman, you cannot use your phone while you drive unless you're hands-free. How may I help you? Call Judy Slate. The city's deputy chief of police, Andy Knight, says that the current ordinance would likely not be affected. It shouldn't affect us and our ability to make an enforcement. It does allow for, as long as there's a, um, a community that has a law that allows people to use uh, hands-free devices such as Bluetooth. Knight says that Bozeman's law is meant to discourage drivers from being distracted. What it's trying to discourage is that distracted driving where you're either texting or talking on a phone, which. Uh, which could get you, um, get somebody uh, into a crash or, or worse. Both Knight and Bauer encourage drivers to just stay off your phone. And we want to let people know to, to be safe, um, put, put the phone down uh, while you're driving. Senate Bill 206 is currently making its way through the Montana House. In Bozeman, Edgar Cidio, MTN News.